Hey family, welcome back to another edition of the Opodo Tivacity Solutions. And uh, in this video, we're going to be looking at a uh, keyboard replacement for this uh, laptop Lenovo ThinkPad T470 model. And we are going to be focusing on replacing the keyboard. It's a faulty keyboard, and we would like to replace it right away. So let's dig into the video and see how we can replace this keyboard right now. So first things first, always first shut down your computer before you do any operation on it. Before you do any uh, dismantle or removing any parts of the laptop. So it's always uh, basic to shut down before you do any activity in regards to repairs. So let's shut down laptop number two. Or after shutting down, you remove the battery rather the external battery in case there is you remove the external battery so for this case let's remove the battery which is this so you have two slots here uh, you open up this slot and then this slot as you slide the battery out so this is the battery we've removed it now that we have removed the battery we have two uh two screws that we need to remove and screw this and this so let's dig in and remove, or rather unscrew this. So we unscrew this screw number one. Then go to screw number two as well. Once we are done, we can, uh, we can then open once we confirm the screws are loose we then open the laptop and then slide open slide open the keyboard uh, the other back side just like this We slide open them to remove the locks. There are locks that attach the keyboard onto the frame. So then we, after, flip the keyboard and then slide, slightly pull it out like this. Then we flip it this other way. Now there are two connectors, there are two connection points here that we need to uh, disconnect of the motherboard. So we first and uh, open the first one, and then the second one. Then this is this is our old non-functional keyboard. Then we get we get our this new one, and uh, let's get rid of this old non-functional one and replace with the new one. In the same spirit, just flip uh turn it the back side and then reconnect these connectors connection one and then connection two point also lock it very well then flip close the keyboard just like this make sure it first enters that side then press it downwards as you slide it back into the locks gently slide it gently back into the locks you can use the help of this the minus screwdriver and ensure that it fits in very well so once it's done fitting in you can then close the laptop and then tighten and then tighten our screws. Tighten our screws. And tighten our screws. Our two screws, this and this. So once we are done, we can now then reconnect our battery. We can now reconnect our battery. And then 
we turn it on, we turn the connector, the computer on to test. And 